Emily and I blog over at The Journey of Parenthood. Today I'm doing a room reveal of our son Spears Mickey themed nursery. Be sure to subscribe to our channel to follow along with all of our family fun. Thanks! Here's the view when you first walk in the room. Spears is our fourth child and we're a huge Disney family but have actually never done a Disney themed nursery before. So we were really excited to add some touches of Mickey. We didn't want it to be overly Disney or too many details where it would be tacky, but just a modern take, simple details to bring in our favorite mouse. First up, let's talk about the wall. It is my favorite detail of the room. Um, Zach did an incredible job. He cut each piece of wood and stained and painted it himself and then put the whole thing together to create this really awesome modern wall behind Spears' crib. We always like a clock in each of our nurseries. It makes it great to tell the time when it's time for naps or <laughs> bedtime. Um, so we have that above the door. And then for the crib, we've used the same crib for all four of our children. I am five foot one. So definitely have a short person struggle of reaching down into the crib. So I love that our crib has that fold down feature to make it really easy to get my babies in and out. We got our crib sheets with the Mickey head detail. They're from Modern Burlap and I'm obsessed with them. It's actually one of the main items um, that inspired this whole room. And then we also used an Etsy shop to make our custom crib skirt. There are small details of buttons to kind of bring out the Mickey theme. I like to have a chair in each nursery, just a good place to sit and cuddle baby when they might be crying or needing that extra loving. We got this chair from Ikea and it has the details of the blanket that Zach's grandmother made for Spear. Thank you, Mima. Zach bought this classic Mickey from Disney World before we were even matched. He just fell in love with it and loves the old school Mickey. This wall here was probably the most difficult part of putting together the nursery. I really struggled with what to put here. Um, we bought the clock prior to being matched as well on an Ikea trip and thought the little pop of yellow was perfect to, again, just have a touch of the Mickey theme. My dad and my stepmom got uh, several Mickey items for the nursery and this old bank was one of them. We spray painted it silver to kind of keep the modern um, appeal of the room but still wanted to leave like the cool, like old school Mickey look. We got a shadow box to put it in and I found the strong and brave quote from Hobby Lobby. I have blackout curtains in every single nursery. It's very important to help with baby sleep, to have the room really dark. And I was really excited about this curtain rod. Um, we knew that we were gonna name our son Spear and wanted to have this arrow as a little reminder of his name and just how much it means to our family. And along with the arrow representing Spear, part of his name, um, the, the name Bryant actually means strong. So I love that we have this as a reminder also that his name has a lot of strong meaning and purpose. I also adore the way this wall turned out. We bought these letters from Hobby Lobby and painted them to match the theme. Um, if you're a Disney fan, then you know that one of Mickey's common phrases is, oh boy. So not only does it fit for the Mickey theme, but obviously we have a son, so it fits that as well. Um, it was tricky for me to decide on a diaper changing pad cover. I love the stripe as it adds another textured element to the room. It's tricky with the white furniture to not have too much white in the room, so I think it's a perfect detailed touch. We always have a sound machine in our nurseries, as well as I love having a touch lamp. And that way when the baby it's time to wake up, it's a gentle, soft way to wake them. And obviously a diaper pail. <laughs> Gotta have a place to throw those diapers away. And we have learned if you keep it in the closet, you end up stacking the dirty diapers up on the changing table rather than actually throwing them away each time. So this encourages us to toss as we go. <music> Last but not least, we have the closet. It's important to me to have lots of storage. So I love those cube storage shelves. 
Um, I have one in every single kid's room. It's especially useful when they're infants because their clothing is so tiny, you can easily store it there, keep things organized. I love these baskets and couldn't resist getting them as well. Um, I'm a baby wise mom, and so we all know that routine of eat, play, sleep, repeat. I thought that was just a perfect fit for a baby wise baby. I love the hamper we purchased and completed it with an elephant stuffed animal that I've had since my first child was born back nine years ago. So it's been in most of our nursery since then. We also always have a bookshelf in every room for our children to store all their favorite books and stories. And it's so neat passing this down from each child. Fear loves his room and we do too. We hope you enjoyed this video and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more. Thanks.